This is one of my favorite recovery moves that Yanzud is doing here. I definitely am not doing these in a downhill race, but where I utilize this the most often is doing GS turns in moguls, skiing moguls and powder skiing with bumpy terrain, and occasionally on rolls on groomers doing some carved turns. What is it? Basically, this is just a tactic that if you're backseat in the air, you touch your tails down into the snow first. This causes a little friction and starts slowing down your skis and therefore allowing your body to catch up with your feet. In moguls and powder, it is not often about getting back seat. Sometimes you can intentionally do this when you're trough skipping doing GS turns in the moguls. If you see you have missed time to take off to skip across a trough, then you can extend your legs and push the tails down onto the face of the bump. This can dissipate some of the force through the tail of the ski and this allows you to get forward again too, just like discussed earlier. You need to be careful that you get the pressure on the tails correct as if you have too much of this you can lever on the back of the boot and this can put stress on your calf and you can get some good boot bang. Also doing this only works at a certain speed. You tend to be going pretty fast to utilize this move and it's generally a recovery one. All my close friends in Aspen when we were going free skiing I would see them do it all the time as we were often doing GS turns through the bumps and especially on powder days with moguls underneath. These slow motion clips show you exactly how it's executed. If you'd like to learn more and improve your skiing, I highly recommend you head over to the Projected Productions website and sign up for the all access pass that has seven plus hours of ski instructional material from the world's best ski coaches and instructors. 